Several months and $17 million later, it looks like New Zealand is going to keep its flag. The first results of a referendum show that more than half of voters want to stick with their current one. I'm naturally a little bit disappointed that the flag didn't change tonight, but I think there's a huge amount that New Zealanders can be very proud of. For a start off, we had a record turnout in the number of people who posted uh, their uh, ballots back and returned them, 2.2 million New Zealanders. Some people were after the change to get rid of the Union Jack from the country's former colonial ruler Britain and to stop their flag from being confused with Australia's. But critics called the alternative a beach towel. We've had a great debate about it and uh, you know, in the end um, I, I've always believed in a system where we ask the people for constitutional issues. It would be very easy for me to get up and get 61 votes in Parliament and change the flag. But actually I don't believe in that. I think that's an arrogant approach to constitutional issues. I don't believe you should do that. So 16 months later, it looks like the hacker over this issue has been all squared away.